hi guys welcome to my channel yes as you can see I, i'm bringing you guys a different video today okay um so welcome to my channel this is cool easy word and in here i create all things faith relationship lifestyle and model video <laughs> okay guys so i want to show you guys my exercise that i do every single day every single day to bring this baby head down all righty <laughs> to bring the little head down and to get him engaged in my pelvic so i wrote oh, I, I went for my uh 30 several weeks ultrasound and um and she was like i'm sorry i can't even take his picture because he's so head down like she can't even get his face <laughs> but she gave me something but i'm like i'll i'll deal with that <laughs> so i'm gonna show you guys what i do my daily exercise to engage baby in my pelvis are you guys ready so let's dive into today's video I do is this my bouncing ball okay I bought this bouncing ball for my daughter and I miss the same thing for this baby okay so the first thing I do is I just bounce on the ball I bounce so like now I'm in the living room right now and instead of me to like sit on the chair and relax my back then I just bounce and watch movie with everybody my husband and the children and just have fun okay so i'm gonna do this for like five minutes i can stop and watch a little bit of movie and as you can see i'm sitting up i'm not like this <laughs> or oh, i'm not like this so i'm just sitting up i'm sure that my shoulder is like straight okay so guys but disclaimer 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 I will advise you to do some kind of exercises that sometimes it's good for you to speak to your healthcare provider for them to tell you if you can do some exercises. Some women that they cannot do some kind of exercise that I do because of health, some kind of health issues or something. So you want to make sure that you discover with your health, your your provider before you do any kind of exercise that I'm actually going to be telling you that I am currently doing in this pregnancy to engage my baby in the pelvis. Okay. So and I was saying before, so I just keep bouncing on the ball. I do it for like five minutes. So you can also grab a ball and do it with me. So sometimes I spent I spent um like 10 minutes, 15 minutes on my ball, but I make sure that I bounce on my ball and I make sure that I um, I can't. I time it so that I know when to stop doing it. But randomly, I love to sit on my because when I sit on the chair, it's, it's more like it's, it's, it has like he's kind of trying to push me kind of thing. So that I love to I love to sit down here because it's kind of body soft. So as I'm jumping, as I'm bouncing, everybody's fine. It's okay. I'm okay. Everybody's happy. <laughs> so I just keep bouncing, bounce, bounce. I am bouncing in the Lord every day. Hey, hey. I am bouncing in the Lord. Bouncing in the Lord. I am bouncing in the Lord every day. Bounce, bounce, bounce. I am bouncing in the Lord every day. Bouncing in the Lord. I am bouncing in the Lord every day. So guys, so when I'm done bouncing like this, like I see, I, I do different methods, but I do the bouncing first like five minutes. When I'm done bouncing, and I go round, around. So I go wide, very wide, guys. Very, very wide. But I wash my TV and just hold my waist and I just go round, around. And as you can see, my legs are open. I did my legs are not like this. My legs are wide open. So I just round. So I do this for like three minutes, five minutes if I like. As long as I can do it, sometimes I will say, okay, you know what? 
let me just count to 20. <laughs> so I just do one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So when I'm done, I can when I'm done, I can still keep bouncing. Just bounce for like three times. So we just wait this way. I'm gonna go this way right now. Just to rest. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, ten, then I bounce again to that. This thing helped me so much because at some point my thighs were hurting, I couldn't walk well. So when I do that exercise, it kind of stretches my thighs, my legs, and um, <laughs> and it makes me feel so good. And I feel better. I feel so good. So I just bounce again. So when I've because me balancing it just me trying to catch a deep breath, okay, to relieve me of that turning because right now it was beginning to hit me a little bit. So I just bounce just to put my body back. So when I'm done and I feel relief and I just go front and I go back. I go front, I go back. One two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Then I bounce again. Okay, I do my bouncing again just to make me so I can catch the breath. <laughs> so I bounce again, I just play around, I just play around, just have fun with it. Don't like do it like it's an exercise I need to do. Just have fun with it. Just do whatever you're doing, watch your TV, do everything you're doing, play with your phone, and just chat. Alrighty, just chat or talk to your kids with your husband. Jeez. So when I'm done with that, the next thing I do is I take I bring this leg right here. Okay, then this one I stretch this leg down. Then I hold my side here and I count one, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, so I bring it up. I do same for this one. See, guys. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So when I'm done with this one, I bounce again to catch my deep breath. Now the next one I'm about to show you guys, where if you the, the, the doctor tells you that your baby is not egg down. I remember I did this stuff for my daughter and I'm like gosh they told me I was I was at 33 34 weeks I was thought she wasn't head down I'm like what why girl and I'm like you know what doctor give me a week I'll be back <laughs> this baby when I come back will be head down and what did I do I'm gonna show you guys in a bit okay so after I finish bouncing this way then I take a deep breath I, I was supposed to know this shoe, 
But I'm going to take it off right now because I'm about to show you guys something magical. Okay. Okay. So then what I do is this. I put this right here. I hope you guys can see what I'm doing. Put this right here. Take the second one. <laughs> this one doesn't want to leave me. <laughs> okay, I go like this. So what I do this when the kids are sleeping because I know that <laughs> they will try it. <laughs> so I make sure that they are asleep when I'm doing this particular one. Guys, this one is magical. Trust me. And I go this way. Okay. Now my legs are on the couch right now. Then I just bring my end down. Okay. Alright, are you guys seeing what I'm doing? And I go this way. And I just stay for like five minutes. For the sake of this video. I'm going to count, say, then stop. But I do this often when I was told my baby was bridge. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Get up. <laughs> okay. Then I get up, grab my bouncy ball again, then sit on my bouncy ball, and just bounce. Then bounce again. Woo, we feel it right here. But I can just sit down and just keep watching my TV. So these are the exercises that I do and daily basis because i'm sure that i keep the baby engaged down there so that labor is easier and faster for me all right i hope you guys enjoy this my exercise routine everyday routine another thing that i do is i take some i take walk outside if i choose to if i don't want to take work i just hop on this and we get the ball rolling <laughs> all right so i hope you guys like this video if you do Please kindly give it a thumbs up. Please like it. Please kindly share this video. Let's share this video. Let's help another to know how they to know the kind of ex daily exercise they can do to keep things going. You get what I mean? <laughs> All right, guys. So thank you so much for tuning in today. God bless you. Bye. <laughs> As usual, I leave you all in the hand of my white Bye. Meanwhile.